Arthur, you have 18 points one game, a double-double the next, and then 20 points tonight. Just how closely is this to what you envisioned when you came to Kansas State? Uh, I mean, it's about the vision that I had, you know, for myself. But, of course, like, the coaching and the staff preparing me for these moments, you know, preparing me for these games and, like, understanding where I was coming from at the start of the season to where I'm playing now, it's just a blessing from God and it's a blessing to have a coaching staff that believe in me in the way they do. How would you assess your progress so far? Uh, man, I'm just slowing down, letting the game come to me, getting my teammates involved. And uh, my teammates do a great job of, you know, checking on me, checking it, like checking me in practice about shots I take and, you know, reads that I should make. And I feel like that's overall getting me better as a player. So all praise goes to them. David, what kind of asset has Arthur been to this team so far this season? Uh, <clears throat> um, I mean, stats kind of tell it. You can get get buckets in a lot of different ways. Um, you know, just having another older guy with experience on the team that, you know, played a lot of basketball games in the tournament, uh, made a great run as well, um, a lot of experience. So I feel like he bring a lot of different things. Uh, not just scoring, you know, he also defense and rebounds at a high level. So all the things you can use to, you know, trying to build this thing. Uh, David, how nice was it just to have Naquan back out there tonight on the bench? Uh, it was great, man. You know, he's a great guy. Uh, always funny to be around. And, you know, he just brought great energy <clears throat> to the bench. Uh, it's good to have him there. Yes, Caleb. Um, you know, players have said that they haven't even seen what your potential is. How much do you still feel like you have in store? Uh, I feel like I have a lot. Like me coming in as a freshman, I just like play my role and just do whatever I need to do to help the team win. So I feel like going forward, like me just keep continue to work and get better. I feel like I really do something special and be a real big part of this team. Michael, can you walk us through the uh, one-handed putback dunk? Oh, yeah, I got you. <laughs> so, uh, like, when I threw the ball in, like, me, I, it was some, some just clicked in my head, like, I know it's going to come off this side. So I just hurried up and ran that bounce and just dunked it. It was crazy. Like, it's something I've always been doing, though. So <laughs> it's pretty normal to me, but everybody else said it was crazy. <laughs> I guess sir. for all of you guys, since we get to, get, get to talk to you after uh, the Miami game, how much did, did the Bahamas experience kind of help you guys kind of gel in, into what, what, what you guys are trying to get to this season? I mean, I feel like playing against that level of competition, you know, it also like boosts like your togetherness as a team because if you're not together out there, you know, it could get bad. But the fact that we came together, especially in that Miami game, and, you know, we fought back. I feel like that really helped improve, like, and helped us find our identity. You know what I'm saying? Who we got to be as a team in order to win tough games from start to finish. Yeah, I agree with Art. Uh, you know, being in those situations, you know, being down and having to fight back, you really see what your teammates are about. Um, even in the profit of this game, going to overtime, you know, trying to stay calm, knowing that we're prepared for this uh, and coming out with a win. Uh, I felt like that was a big time game for our team and our chemistry and, you know, going forward. <clears throat> and then you guys had more rebounds than any K-State and team in over 20 years. I know that tonight, I know that that was a big emphasis going into the season, but, but how nice is that to kind of see that hard work paying off? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, you know, thank God. We put in a lot of work. Um, the coaches emphasize it, like you said. Um, they show it on film. Uh, I mean, yeah, we emphasize it a lot. And today we got a lot of rebounds. So, I mean, you know, we work on it. Uh, glad to see it work out. Just with your second double-double of the season, six games into the year, what does that say about you gaining more confidence? Um, I just want to give all the honor and glory to God. You know, I've been putting in a lot of work this off season. Um, you know, just going out there, trying to play the right way, um, trying to do the right things. 
helping this team uh, build, you know, <clears throat> prepare for, you know, to make a run in March. Um, obviously, it's nice to see uh, all my work hard pay off, hard work pay off, but I'm mean, here. Yeah. <laughs> Any other questions for these guys? Okay. Thank, Thank you. you guys. Sir, sure. thank you. Thank you.